there are so many women like me or in a you know even worse situation than me and it's not okay you know this is the 21st century and covid you know no one can travel a lot of australian and new zealand women were going overseas to try and find a donor or whatever i mean we should have our own egg bank here why don't we have our own egg bank i know there's a lot of you know regulatory hurdles um, but come on we need to sort this out it's just too much of an impact on so many families not to have access to this service. There are avenues available for women in Australia to receive donor eggs, but is your concern that there simply isn't enough supply? Look, I, I've heard it said that, you know, if, if there were enough willing donors, then we'd have an egg bank. And I just think that that's not true because firstly, women don't know that there's a need for eggs. So I think that if Australian women knew that other women needed their support in that capacity, that they'd be more than willing to, you know, volunteer to provide donor eggs, you know, in a clinic setting um, for some of these women. But it's not promoted, people don't know. This is this silent issue. People don't even talk about IVF, let alone egg donation. You know, if you're doing IVF, it's like this secret thing that women go through, secret women's business. And egg donation is even more on the down low, you know, so it's like a shameful thing, you know, and and there are feelings of shame and failure. You know, it's like I'm a failure because I need an egg donor. Well. You know, like I've missed my biological clock. I've kind of messed up in the worst possible way. Um, and I don't want to tell anyone. And it's like, well, you shouldn't feel like that because you haven't messed up. And it's just a social construct. You know, we're pushed to be career women. We're pushed to have it all, do it all, be it all, be everything. And yet we're supposed to have kids as well, you know, when we're young. And it's like something's got to give. I think there'll be a lot of women watching who echo those sentiments. Emma? Yeah, I, I think there's a lot of really good reasons why we should start looking seriously at educating young women to go and freeze their eggs and subsidising that um, to remove all of this future grief and cost from the public purse um, and with the possibility that they could then donate any eggs that they didn't want to use to the Australian Egg Bank, which doesn't yet exist, um, for women who uh, end up being in a, a difficult situation and need them. It doesn't make sense to me that we don't have an egg bank. It just doesn't make sense. Because if we have a sperm bank, then that shows that there's a need. It may be just that it's overlooked. Maybe it's because it's easier to manage a sperm bank or less controversial, less invasive or less expensive. I don't know. It can be a bit more complicated, can't it? I mean, it's not just necessarily an egg. You might also need a sperm. You might also need a surrogate. There are various layers to this. Definitely layers. And look, um, egg donation is invasive. You know, it's, it requires a commitment of weeks and, you know, injections and drugs and a procedure. It's not as easy as a sperm donation. And, yet, you know, there are, yes, there's surrogacy. There's all kinds of complex issues in the fertility landscape in Australia. You've become, ironically, the poster girl for egg donation. <laughs> I know. Wow, is that what I wanted to be known for? <laughs> I don't think so. <laughs> but, you know, if it does some good and it helps some other people and, you know, if more women start to volunteer as egg donors, then, you know, that's, that's a bunch of people who are going to have a much happier family life and a much happier life and, and maybe we'll get a world egg bank, I mean, an Australian egg bank, you know, maybe, maybe some good will come of it. Hello, I'm Tara Brown. Thanks for watching 60 Minutes Australia. Subscribe to our channel now for brand new stories and exclusive clips every week. And don't miss out on our Extra Minutes segments and full episodes of 60 Minutes on 9now.com.au and the 9Now app.